she comes on. Okay, so. Oh. Okay, so everybody okay with the recording? Use the mouse and hit the got it. Oh, okay. Got it. Got it. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. <laughs> a lot of little technical help there. <laughs> well, thanks for coming, guys. You know, this is the, a night we look forward to, and hopefully next next year, our referral team and and all of our supporters are going to be able to come and actually join us here for the evening with some wine and cheese and some a bit of a party and uh, give away some more gifts and stuff. So. We're just going to have to do the gift thing and uh, make sure that uh, we have shown our appreciation for all your guys' help because, you know, without your support, you know, it just makes life so much harder. And we're so glad to be able to give back and, you know, the people that you refer to us, make sure that they're well taken care of because that's the trust that you put in us. So uh, with all that, I'd like to introduce Fred Mercer and he is um, the owner of Expedia and he is going to uh, give us a little bit of a talk about how travel is changing with COVID and how it's starting to evolve and come back. So Fred, take yeah. it away. Thank you, Linda. And before I jump into travel, because when I do, I never come out of it. <laughs> I just wanted to say thank you. Uh, we're so happy to be able to partner with Linda. Um, she was just telling me as well, and I was anxious to hear how they're doing and their business is doing so well. And it's so wonderful to see, but I'm not surprised after meeting you and your team the last few years, you're so good. And so referrals would not be hard for you to come by. So congratulations on another banner year again. Thank you. Um, yes, uh, you know, for us, I think Mike Banner, congratulations to my team, my manager there, Kelly, you can wave Kelly and Mike's in the background. Mike, I see you there. Um, our congratulations hopefully will come in another year or two because travel is just coming back. And um, it, it's, it's, um, it's what we call a messy travel time right now, but it's um, nonetheless, there are people actually moving. So there's actually people uh, on beaches like it's behind me in this background which some people know and maybe some people on this call have been able to already get away but we're sending more and more people away the ease of uh, the restrictions around travel have come down a lot in the last few weeks um, we've we've had about i think as about 14 or 18 percent more people that have booked travel in the last two weeks to travel before the end of the year so that's an interesting stat um, as we look at the world as well some countries are still closed, uh, like Australia, and then there are other countries that are wide open and uh, and uh, having no problem. The cruise lines, you know, one of our specialties, of course, we do it all, um, you know, air, land, and sea vacations, but cruising is uh, one of our specialties, and uh, the cruise lines are doing a fabulous job. I just read the other day, 600,000 people have now cruised in the last five months, and of those 600,000, we had 1,300 positive COVID tests. So out of 600,000, I guess you can calculate the percentage there. It's apparently quite low and the CDC and everybody else are quite pleased that the cruise lines decided to, instead of be defensive, they would say, let's create the safest um, traveling bubble that we can going forwards, no matter what happens in the world. And gosh darn it, they've done it. So they make sure everybody is um, clean when they're coming in and um, vaccinated. Uh, and then when they get on board, uh, they have such great protocols and great uh, medical systems that um, they are able to go around the world and just move this healthy bubble everywhere they need to go. And uh, some of them are so confident that if you test positive after you get on board, they'll actually, well, they gotta send you home, but they'll do it via private jet. And so can you imagine, that's how confident they are. Um, and so there's a lot of different things, but our team uh, in Kamloops have been so phenomenal. I was just telling Linda, because our team is kind of shy there sometimes, but they're tracking so far ahead of every other Expedia Cruises location in Canada that is uh, supposedly the size of Kamloops and population. Um, the team has been on fire for training and learning new things. And so we feel really confident um, about being able to help people with travel, no matter what they're doing, whether they're going for a flight or an all-inclusive to Mexico, or if they're doing a cruise, we can really help them out. Um, so hopefully if you know anybody or you're talking to people that are struggling or kind of scratching their head going, I don't know what to do about travel, send them 
our way. Kelly's a manager there. Mike's one of the great pillars of our company and um, they will not be disappointed. I guarantee you. So that's, that's, how's that for a synopsis of travel, Linda? That's very good. Thank you so much. Um, so I understand you've got a meeting to go to. I do. Uh, and uh, thank you very much. I'm so glad I'm running meeting to meeting. And I asked Kelly, <laughs> could I get in here in a couple of seconds? And she said, yes. So thank you. So we appreciate you giving us that time. So whenever you have to log off, you just feel free to go ahead with that. Yep. And in the meantime, there you, there you go. Two I've seconds. got two minutes. I've got, I've got okay. two minutes. So well, what we're going to do is because so few could actually, or, you know, make the effort or had time in their schedule, everybody who zoomed in is going to get uh, a, a gift uh, from, uh, and this is from Expedia. And so what it is, is uh, it's a travel uh, document pouch. And I told them that I want one too. We're giving her one. <laughs> so, but it keeps, you know, your passport, your plates and all that. And then they've stuck all kinds of fun little things inside. There's sunglasses in this one and there's all, all, all kinds there's of stuff coupons, in there. So, who, and lots of coupons. So there's all kinds of uh, more, it gets a gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> so each one of you will be giving one of these just because you took the time to join us tonight. We really appreciated that. Having a party and nobody showing up is really, really sad. <laughs> so thank you. So this is our thank you, you guys. So having uh, said that, what we're gonna do is we've got several gifts before the big one. We've got backpacks, we've got a dinner out and wine. We've got, um, and we've got a whole picnic set. So let's get right after it and um, and do some drawings. So we're gonna get you, my dear. Oh yeah, that's a really good idea. I'll keep you on point. So I wanna make sure I introduce everybody because there were some introductions made already uh, with the Expedia team, I must introduce my team. And so first uh, we've got Christy. Christy Genota, and of course you guys all know her, and uh, she's my buyer specialist, and is getting starting to get into the listing thing. I'm starting to push her that way too. And then we've got Adam Pupin, and he is um, our right hand man. And so whenever we need uh, more help with, he's got his own client base, plus he's got listings and and sales that he's doing uh, is as part of the team as well. And then Marcy, who holds us all together. So <laughs> she keeps track of all of us so that we have all of our uh, our I's and T's dotted and we don't miss anything and end up making sure the deals all go smooth. So that takes all the team is all together now. Thank you, my dear. <laughs> all right, so back to why we're here. So I'll let you draw first. Right, so we are drawing for one of the, yeah. what have we got, ladies? Yeah, we've got a oh, drum roll. Basket. Basket, okay. basket. I'll let you read names okay. you know those folks. Oh, okay, so this is Robert DeMores. And uh, he oh. and his wife will enjoy uh, going out for dinner, I'm sure. So we'll make sure. Now, these are going to go off to the side for now. And um, oh, they get to go in for the big drop. They get to go back okay. in for the big drop. Wonderful. Okay. So, Marcy, are you going to write down some? I will. Yeah. Okay, so that um, wine basket goes to Robert DeMaurice. Okay, there you go. All right. I lost my drum roll. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> She's keeping us on point. <laughs> okay, and all right, so this one, uh, what else do you need? The picnic basket? Oh, it's basket. so cute. Yeah, this is, this is uh, from BC Lotteries. Oh, and it's got a little cutting board for your cheese and crackers. It's got plates and cutlery and a wine uh, wine cooler thing in the back. And that's going to go to Dave and Wendy Neal. So we'll make sure that these people all get the gift delivered to them. All right, drum roll, please. Woo, keep on going. So we have a full backpack, and this one's going to Fred and Donna Schroeder. So again, we'll make. Fred, I bet you thought that was going to be you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yep. Okay. And so another backpack. Well, this one's got an Expedia Cruises water bottle with it. Yeah, and then the remax. This one you can pack and go for a weekend. All right, and this one. Is give me another drum roll on this one. 
Marie and Jamie Campbell. Yay! Yay. <laughs> Actually on the on the Zoom. So okay, so that one's there. We so the Remax one. And nice. so we've got one, two, that, that's so that's four. That's yeah. 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 Okay. So these all go back. Are you pulling up again? Yeah, I can Some? do that. Sure. Well, then just doing that, I just want to reintroduce myself. My name is Kelly. I'm the manager here at Expedia Cruises. We're really hoping that uh, we can all get together personally in our office here next time. Uh, we are up behind the Toys R Us in the Summit Plaza. Uh, Mike is our number one uh, travel agent here in our office, but of course we've got a ton of them who come and go and uh, look after all the desks that are here. Uh, we'd love to see your faces. We'd love to see you guys come in and say hi anytime you want. If you have questions about travel, we're certainly here to help you, even if you're not ready to book, but you just have questions about it. We're certainly here to help you along. So please come and see us up in uh, the Summit Plaza whenever you're ready. All right, so here comes the big one. And what does this person win? This get? person gets a $1,500 uh, gift certificate through Expedia to use whatever kind of a trip you want. Anything. So, so you can come in and, and see yeah. Mike, and Mike will take care of you on that one. And uh, we'll set that all up for you. And so here we go. We will hit somebody who's. Ooh, we had somebody who was on the last year, didn't we? That was pretty exciting. All right, I'm here. giving it a good stir. There's lots of them in there. This is our team have done really hard. In. All right, and uh, there is our winner. Bryson Huckle up. So <laughs> not here, but he's going to be a happy, happy guy when we give him a phone call tonight. So. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll love, you know, thank, I just want to again say thank you very much for your support without referrals from uh, from you folks and uh, if you were the ones that were referred and, and got, you know, we helped you. We're so glad that we were able to do that and uh, look forward to another year. And again, any referrals that come in, you'll be in the draw next year too. So, any, anybody have any questions of us? No, we'd just like to thank you, Linda. Thanks. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much, Linda. Yes, you're welcome. Thank you. It was a pleasure working with all of you this year and uh, enjoying your enjoy your new homes. And uh, how's Saskatchewan, you guys? Marie and Janie. Oh, oh, we're in Medicine Hat, Alberta. Yeah. Alberta. yeah. Very, very close to Saskatchewan, but <laughs> we're, we're doing our very best to solely keep the economy of Medicine Hat going. Uh, just us two. So. <laughs> well done. Well done. Well done. <laughs> All right. Well, have a good evening, everybody. Again, thank you very much for signing in. We appreciate your support. So thank, thank you. Thank you. Good night. Bye. Take care. Say, say hi to Brian, Linda. No, I will. Okay. <laughs> okay. So we need to have to fill that.